Thank you for checking out Auto Drills videos. This video is to demonstrate how simple it is to adjust the overall stroke length of an auto drill machine. This applies to our 2000 series, to our 5000 series, and roughly to our 1000 series as well. Uh, regardless of the length of stroke that the machine has, whether it's one and a half inch or nine inch maximum stroke, the following procedure will show you the basic steps to adjusting the stroke of an auto drill. First thing we're going to do is show you um, essentially there's a nut on the front of the unit that you turn to move this stop block in the back. Uh, right now we're going to stop moving the stop block and you'll see that this unit will stroke only as far as that stop block allows it to. When it's fully stroked forward you'll see that the trigger in this case for a set of proximity sensors which are not loaded on the machine yet will move forward with the block and of course on the stop collar on the front the trigger for the proof of return will also uh, move back into the same position every time. When you adjust the stroke of this machine by turning the, the fastener on the front with some type of a, uh, a ratchet like we're using here or even a wrench, you move this stop block and you can make finite adjustments to the unit itself. This unit happens to have a maximum of four inches of stroke. It could be dialed down to probably less than half an inch of total stroke if necessary. And of course this adjustment is the same whether there is a chuck on the front as you see here an ER style collet chuck, uh, whether it's a key type chuck, a multiple spindle head, a tapping head, whatever it may be. If you have any questions, please contact us at AutoDrill at 800-871-5022 or 908-542-0244, that's for international callers, or of course on the web at autodrill.com or drill-hq, like headquarters.com. Thank you very much.